going on, YouTube? It's your boy Sam from Team Sam Rex one here. And today, guys, I'm coming at you with a very awesome YCS Day 2 deck profile today. Bro, what were you playing? I was playing Block Dragon BA. Block Dragon BA? Yeah, bro. Okay. This deck's crazy. Like, okay. it, you can, it can push too many hand traps and, like, it's so broken. Like, no one expects it and stuff. Okay, and what does this deck do? It just makes, like, a really good board, like, Fossil Dino, Dweller, Beatrice, and, like, you can have an Orbital. And like the fossil sign is pumped up with Saruja. And like no one can break that. And if they like have a threat, you just like far from whatever and just OTK him next to it. Wow, that's pretty crazy. Yeah. That's pretty crazy. And why did you this, and, and why did you decide to play this deck uh, for this event? Oh, because I thought like no one know what it does. Like so many people did like wrong things to it. Like it pushes through many hand traps. Like my, my Tori has got an ash, but like I have so many extenders, like it doesn't matter. So, so your deck is basically extender dot deck. Yeah, like it just makes through you... this deck and like block dragon like 30 times. Block dragon and you summon fossil dino. Yeah, said. at the end, yeah. Okay. And uh, yo, don't don't they have this new X XCs now that searches fossil dino or something? Yeah, it searches fossil dino and block dragon. It's the, it's the, it's the new one in the new set. Oh, it's called uh, Granite yeah. Lotus. Yeah, this card's yeah, like broken. Wow. I can also search the Nibiru as well, right? Yeah, this card's really good. Like, so good. Okay, okay, awesome. Yeah. Uh, and I actually saw you on stream around 9, right? Yeah, bro. Like, oh, it was unfortunate. That's the only, that was one of the only games I break. Like, it was so bad. I couldn't, like, show the deck off and stuff. Okay, but don't worry. We're here now. <laughs> uh, can you please show us the combo at the end? I'll, yeah, I'll for sure. I'll show that. Okay. okay. All right, All okay. Right. All right, let's go over that deck profile. All right, so I play, like, one of every BA. Except for Rubik, because Rubik's, like, really bad. But, like, this is extenders and stuff. So like I pay every one of every BA because they're all once per turn. And I just wanna like open up two BAs and like one extender. And it's like full combo and stuff. So and one like, BA and one so two BAs and one extender is a full combo, you said? Yeah. Cause wow. you just cycle through your deck and you just like start milling everything. And you mill like a bunch of herbs for like block dragon and stuff. Right. Yeah. Okay, like cool. obviously this is like the best one. Like this one's the one that you do all the time. Like the only one you really care about using is this one. Because right. this one's part of the combo and stuff. Like the rest of them you don't really care. Right. So, yeah. Okay, so one of each BA, cool. Yeah, except, except for Rubik. Rubik. Yeah, Rubik doesn't do anything. Uh, and then I played uh, two Mathematician. Oh, this card's really good because of one card I play in my, in my deck. It makes this a one card chair beanie. It's like really broken. It's funny because against uh, Pendulum, uh, round eight, uh, I play against Jeremy Mitchell. And he, uh, and I know most of the Mathematician for his game. And he just scoops it up because he thought I was playing Orcus. I was like, damn, if you knew what I was playing, you're like, you're like, why would I scoop against BA? But right. it was so funny. This right. card's broken. It like sets up everything. And then for the extenders, I play this. These two. Because uh, sometimes it's, it's really hard to like push Suruja. And you like just need free cards to like push against Suruja. And this helps against like going second. Because it helps you make like Nightmare and stuff. It's an Earth. It's like, it's just really good. And then uh, for the one ofs that are like broken. So I play all these. Like this is what you like normally send off like Cherubini and stuff. And like these two. Like this card's broken. Like. There's games where like I open up Tour Guide and you can like chain block if you like send this first. Right. You'll be like one, two, and they can't ash this and you just have full combo. Right, right, right. And like this is like where you normally send off like the Cherubini and stuff. And if like if they do ash the Tour Guide, you just summon this and you just full combo and stuff. Mm. And it's like really broken. It doesn't matter. Sometimes it doesn't even matter. This will, this will be like the probably the last thing to do. You make curious for this deck? Oh no, no, I don't. No, no curious? No, no curious. Okay, awesome. <laughs> And then for the, the broken threes, this card's broken. Like in time, it's like free. It's really free because you just you just reveal and you just know like a cloud jack and like like orbital. I play orbital, so like you just burn for free. And this card's really good. It's like a, probably one of the best cards. Nice. And then for the one ofs, are these? These cards are broken. This makes uh, I, I play the cherry beast, so this makes me cherry beast. This comes back with block jack. This card's just broken. And this card, uh, this is the card I was talking about with magnetician. You can just. Uh, mathematician because of one card Cherubini, so you just dump this, and then because it's a level 3 token, so you just make Cherubini and you just do the combo. So, like, it's pretty good. Awesome. And then for the for the rock engine, it's three Rock Dragon and three Gigantus, and then World of Fossil Dino. So, normally in the combo, when you like you resolve Rock Dragon with Suruja, you normally add one of this and one of this because you'll, you'll use this to like special and mix the Dweller and this at the end for it can be because no one really can get over 16 and if they do you just far foot away right. and this was really good against Rogue because I was really get scared of against Rogue like two Draco and stuff that's probably my hardest matchup because I'm really scared of the floodgates so like I wanted to hear it out just to out the floodgates okay so, and, what is, uh, so, uh, so what does the card do it's a heavy storm right yeah when it's through by battle uh, it's a heavy for your opponent and like you just banish on earth so it's really good i was just really scared and the two dragons won't activate because it's damaged them so like it's just like free right yeah so i just i was just really scared of rogue and stuff nice and then uh for the for the last monsters i play three orbital this card's broken like yeah so like, what does he do so um if you have five or more monsters in your graveyard you can special summon it 
and during either player's turn, at resolution, you mill three, and if nothing in your graveyard is the same, you destroy anything, and it doesn't target. So they would have to act on resolution. Right. Like this card, like, it's really good because uh, I, I lose it to there can only be one, so this is a machine. So like, it just, it just outs that card, and I just pop off next, I, I just keep on popping off. Nice. And it mills Earths, so like, the only, the only, uh, Multiples are Earths, so but you could just manipulate them with Bog Dragon and right. stuff. So like this card's really good. And for like the last card, I didn't play hand traps, but like I just started, I decided to make this. High juice? Yeah, cause you can, you can banish, banish them with Bog Dragon, and it's just, like no one plays around these, no one respects these. Like there's like a couple matches where like, they would make Dweller, and I'll be like, stand on main, and I'll be like, no, it's fine. And I'll be like, and I'll just Kaiju the Dweller, and I'll just pop off, like against our Lunite Knight Orcus, round two. Uh, he had the whole combo and stuff, like Tornado Dragon, Dweller, and stuff. And I was like, stand by main, and he, he's like, that's fine. And I Kaiju the Dweller, and I break, and they're breaking the whole board, right. board and LTK Right. And crazy. it was, it was crazy. And I, like, I, I faced against Zack Stone and stuff, uh, another night Orcus. And like, he didn't do the Dweller either. I just Kaiju the Dweller, and he was so <laughs> mad. He's like, oh. I don't respect kaijus and stuff, but now I do. I'm gonna respect them all the time. And I was like, yeah, you better. Like, yeah. this card's too broken. Like, no one ever plays around it. Wait, and like, right. it shuts down Sky Striker. So like, it's like you just a bonus sword OTK with this. Right. It just like bait out the background and just pop them. So it's really good. It. Yeah, yeah like it. you can crash Gigantes against this and just blow up the whole background and then bonus sword OTK them. Right. So it's like broken. And for like the last three, the, the most broken spell. So like it's like Pot of Greed. Yeah, like this card's broken. Like. Like this card barely got ash. Your whole deck is broken. Yeah, like this card. Did Your whole not deck get is ash. broken, baby. Yeah, this card did not get ash. All right, awesome. Like it was crazy. Like this card's just insane. Like there's no like need to explain. Nice. All right, let's get started with uh, uh, your extra deck. My extra deck. Oh, so for the extra deck, uh, I played uh from the one of Cherubini, Saruja. This is part of the combo. Like the combo is like you, you chain block this. So this is chain link one. Dante is like chain link two. Block Dragon is chain link three, and then Sears chain link four. And he's just like. You just block this for like, you can add the, the rocks and stuff. Like the main purpose of this deck is to like chain block with Suruja. Right. For like the block dragon can always go off. Right. Cause the only ones for chain is the, the searching. The special from Gabe or hand, it's like, it's, it's unlimited. So like, that's right. why. And then I played the unicorn. Cause I play IP, like this is broken. Like discarding Fafra off of this, like it's really good. It's like two interruptions. Yeah. Yeah, so it's really good. Uh, obviously the Phoenix, like this is like the, Portal Sword, like this card's broken. Like you make this every game. Like, I got uh, Nibiru twice. In the tournament, like I was just, I still Boros already to K. Like no one respects this card. Like this card, I'm um, like this card too. Like I lose against Borlo, so this card's broken. And then the IP and uh, Chisbania. Chisbania is really good because the backward decks. Yeah, I, I just don't want to lose to like floodgates and stuff. And you can IP this, so it's really good. Uh, that's it for the links. Nice. Yeah. And then for the XYZs, it's one dollar. Uh, one of the new cards. This card's broken. You just. Add, you, you can have Fossil Dine off of this too, so it's broken. So if you don't have it in the combo, you can just make this and then special it off of the Suruja at the end. Or you can add Brock Jack and just keep going. Nice. And then uh, two Dante. Uh, Most people play one, but I play two because I'm like, I'm really unfortunate. And like, I don't know Brock Jack and I try it. So like, I want to know everything. Right. Yeah, and this card's broken. You just add the back. Like, uh, part of the combo is uh, Farfa. So if you mill it, you can just add it back with this. Right. And like, you can just send it back with Suruja. We right. can beat you it back. And yeah. obviously, the one beat you Best one. Yeah, and then this, like, I don't know why I play this card. Like, this card never came up. Like, this never goes off. Like, yeah. they always Widow Anchor it or, like, Mind Control it. Or, like, they just borrow load it. And, like, so, like, it never goes off. Uh, this will probably be, like, an Appalooza if, uh, next time. Because, like, this card, like, this is a blank. And, like, the, the last card is for the, the global. Like, uh, during the combo, you can either make Dweller or, or this. Yeah. So like depending on what they're playing. The matchup, yeah. Yeah, like my homie was telling me like uh, if they're playing, you should ask your opponent what they're playing and stuff. Like if they're playing more than forty, they're playing combo. But if they're playing like forty, they're probably playing that sky striker. So like I always take that into consideration. Either making this or this. And like this card's like auto win with like fossil dino stuff. Right. All right, let's go up to your side deck. Oh, uh, for the side deck it's kind of weird. So like I played one chaos hunter and two pranger tops. Okay. Like this this card literally never came up. Like, I didn't face any rogue, I just faced like Orcus, and like, this doesn't do anything for us. Oh, Orcus. you're lucky, man. Yeah, like, uh, I'll, I'll say my matches after the after the profile, but like, this didn't do anything. I wish there was a system down. Right. Yeah, because, like, uh, one game, this won me against Orcus, because um, he kaijued me, and I and I discarded Farfa, and I special this. And like, it just blew him out, the Farfa blew him out, and this blew him out. So I'm glad I played this. This will be probably like system down. Like, this card didn't come up at all. Right. Like, this was pretty bad, and like, obviously, like, the. Three Lancia and like the, the MVP was this. Three Vanity Fiend. Like this card's broken. Like no one respects this card. Yeah. Like I remember just 
just slapping this down and people would be scared I'm like damn pass set pass set pass yeah. and I'll just like start setting up and stuff like this guy it went me against like a, like a bunch of games I would just sack like a um like a far front and stuff except for in the, in the future match this car like didn't do anything like the guy just had challenge so like I ended up losing right but like this car was broken against Zuna Knight and stuff like they just don't have any out and I guess like Rogue, I, I was so scared of Rogue, so like I played three Unity and like three Twin Sister. Like, I hate you, Drake, and I hate Sky Shark, so like I just wanted to like play these right. just to like blow them out. Because I can for sure OTK with this deck. Yeah. I was thinking about Red Reboot, but just, but I just didn't want to play like half and yeah. stuff. But oh. yeah, this is like really, really good. Usually you end up with like maybe like no hand chests and stuff, so like, you just need like two, eight, ex two BAs and like any extender and like Black Dragon. So like you special both of these and you lick them off. So block dragon can either, be, can either be in your hand or graveyard, right? Yeah, like this deck goes cycle through this deck really quickly. Like you just you just burn through so many cards. So like you're eventually gonna mill this or draw it. Like if you draw it, it's broken because you just push away from hand. Right. So you make cherry beanie, and you go cherry beanie effect, and you and you end up milling rhino and and graph, and then graph's gonna get the seer. And then with Seer, you special the, the, the Psychic Tracker, and then you overlay for Dante. And you, do, you, you uh, detach the, 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 the Psychic Tracker, because you want to keep the, the Seer for the... The Beatrice. For the, for the Beatrice and the Block Dragon. So you mill three, it doesn't matter what you mill. It just matters if you like if you hit Earths and stuff. So let's say you like hit Earths. Like, like, like if you hit that, and then you go, you go Block Dragon, you special. And you manage three. And you'll get like giant wrecks and stuff. And this is where you like do the Saruja. So you like, you link all four of them. For Saruja. And then you go chilling link one Saruja. And you go chilling link two Block Dragon. Because you don't want them to ash this or anything. Right. And you go chilling link uh, two Dante target anything. And then still get the Dante back. So you can have the beaches to protect the fossils right now. Right. So you add whatever you want off the Block Dragon. And you're gonna draw like random cards. So I say you draw this, and you just shuffle it back, and you can draw like seconds light. So you can like keep going, you can right. get like sticky and stuff. And you get the BA from your hand, so you go like this. And then you go discard, and you get Beatrice. Right. And then you just banish two Earths for that. And you get Dweller, and then at the end, you go to just special this, and then that's the combo. It's game. Yeah, I so like, know that can break this, unless it's like Sky Striker and stuff. But if you, if you know they're playing Sky Striker, you'll make this uh, not Beast. Mm. Yeah, and it's depending on what you draw, this can be like Orbital, or like you can have a Sticky, or you can have a follow up, like it's really good. Wow, that's really good. Wow, that's awesome, bro. Yeah. Robert, thank you so much for this awesome deck profile. Do you have any, anything else you want to say before we end off this video? Oh, yeah. So I want to like say like the matches I had because I like wrote them down for like people don't say like, oh, I like didn't play anything better. Okay, yeah, so what did you play? So like round one, I played against Sue Draco, I 2 0 it. Round two, I played against Lunar Knight Orcus, I 2 0 it. Uh, Sky Striker. Uh, round three, I played against Sky Striker, I got the draw. Unfortunately, he thought some, something happened and he thought like something went wrong and I was like, oh, whatever. And then around four, I, I played against Silent, I 2 one it. And then round five, I played against Thunder Dragon, 2 2 it. Round six, I played against Orcus, I 2 0 it. Round seven, I played against Lunar Knight Orcus, I 2 one it against Zack Stone. Round eight, it was my first loss, round eight. Uh, I played it against Jeremy Mitchell, Pendulums, I, I got 2-1 because he added the fossil sign at the end and like I, I wasted all of my resources on this. Right. And uh, round 10, I 2 0 to Orchest. And then round 11, I 2-1 Silent. Mm. Yeah. So like it did pretty good. I was happy. All my friends were like rooting me on. Like random people would like come up to me and be like, dang, you're the BA guy, you're the BA guy. I hope you do good. I love BA. And I'm like, yeah, I hope so too. But unfortunately, I got, I bubbled out, I got 45th. So it's okay though. I don't really play, but it was really fun. Playing. So you're regular X21, right? Yeah. Okay. You know what? Nonetheless, congratulations on yeah. making day two. Thanks to my homies. Like, I appreciate them. Like, shout out to them. Shout out to all my homies, Fabian, uh, Joey, uh, Angel, the fuck, Mermo God, uh, Roberto, everybody that came along with me, uh, James. I appreciate, I appreciate you. Thank you for having me on the No, no uh, problem, man. No yeah, problem, man. Congratulations, you. bro. Yeah, this is actually good. I hope like people start respecting me and stuff. Guys, like, look at that. It's crazy. Yeah, crazy. like VAs are back. Like, everybody saw them. They're like, what the heck? VAs are back. Like, it's just unfortunate. Like, on the stream, I can't, like, perform. Like, I just break. Like, it was unfortunate. All right, bro. This is your boy, Sam. From right. Team Sam, Sam, Sam. Thank you so much, bro. Thank All right, you. peace. Be sure to get your playmat today at tsx1.com.